we are leaders in, in every place. Um, we're leaders in our family, we're leaders in our community, even if your role is not a leader inside of your specific business. Right now, millennials represent the largest population, 73 million people in the U.S. workforce. They bring to our cultures a new way of having to do business. In the millennial generation, their teammates are their most important people at work. We went to work because we went to work for the leaders that were represented there. And millennials, really, they want to collaborate and synergize and connect with and have relationships and bond with the people that they work with on their team. Your sole responsibility is to your people. If you spend 100% of your time focused on giving them what they need, providing them the resources they need, providing them the encouragement that they need, the motivation, the constructive feedback, all is well in the world because your people will take care of your customer, your customer takes care of your business, and your business takes care of you. So beyond the new leadership, the act of developing and empowering the people in your organization to do what they do best, and then the benefits are greater alignment, greater loyalty, and greater engagement. What else would be needed in clarity? Yes? Clear mission. Clear mission. So what it is that you want to be different when you're done, the ultimate goal. Thank you. I would like for you to write down this one question. And I want you to go back to your office and every single meeting you have, every single conversation that you have, build more clarity by asking, what do we need to be different when we're done here? All right, so I asked the last 150 one-to-one -one meetings, coaching sessions, and leadership groups that I trained, how much clarity does your organization have? And the answer is about two hours a day. Um, being clear on your vision, values, and behaviors, obviously, as a beyond you leader, having that clarity just makes decisions so much easier. The yes becomes yes, hell yes, and the no becomes no. That just does not fit where we're going. If you are really clear on your behaviors, then your systems should amplify that absolutely every single time. I say a Leadership Act is anything that improves and or um, kindles a heart-to-heart -heart connection with the other person in the organization. Shift your thinking about not asking things of your team, but asking how you can be of help to them. It is our responsibility to share the skills and talents that we have to complement the skills and talents of what your team already has. How many of you are mentoring someone else? Who are you bringing along with you? Who's coming along behind you? Transformational moments in my life are those that said, someone said, you might be good at that. Or I have got a special project for you. Or I think you'd be great at this even though you might not know how. How many of you have a formal recognition program in your company? Having reward and recognition creates an incredibly dynamic culture. There's nothing better than actually being appreciated by something that you didn't think was important but was important to someone else and hearing it. So 360 feedback really gives you a 360 degree feedback about how you're showing up behaviors that are helping you, and behaviors that are hurting you or not helping you. If you're not doing mentoring and or coaching for your teams, if you're not getting mentoring and coaching for yourself, if you're not focused on leadership development, those are things that just ensure your long-term success period. Because your people, your millennials, your Gen Yers and Zers, they all want that. And if you don't give that to them, they will leave and start their own company. What's the one or two areas that you're kind of just doing okay at? There is an opportunity for improvement and that area might actually make all of the difference. The future success of all of our organizations are going to be dependent on not doing business the way that it's always been done.